Dr. Fauci's cruel and wasteful experiments on beagle puppies may continue, according to the animal rights group, the White Coast Waste Project. The Fauci-run National Institute of Health, the NIH, is reportedly due to renew taxpayer funding for a whole new round of potentially fatal experiments on 108 beagles in Kansas that will make your skin crawl. The details are amazing. The beagle, I'm sorry, the balance has been following this story very closely, and my next guest has uncovered even more disturbing details. Joining me now to weigh in, White Coat Waste Projects Vice President of Public Policy, Justin Goodman. Justin, just very quickly, the audience uh, of your sent me something, and I, I looked it up. It sounded too ridiculous to be true. Then I did look it up, and it turns out it was right, and you guys have been following this with a FOIA request. Tell us the story. Yeah, Eric, thank you so much for your support and for keeping this issue on the front burner for for taxpayers because they deserve to know how their money is being spent. According to FOIA documents we've received, Dr. Fauci's National Institutes of Allergy and Infectious Diseases is slated at the end of this month to re-up a grant that has cost taxpayers $5 million already, got another half a million dollars last year. And in these experiments, they are planning to take 108 beagle puppies and in the project's description, they say basically they use puppies because they're small and they're easy to abuse. And what they're doing is shaving their fur off, strapping containers full of infectious ticks to their bare skin so they can get uh, a tick-borne illness, uh, and then watching the disease progress and killing them. Uh, the kicker here, in addition to the obviously cruel experiments, is that this is completely wasteful and un unnecessary. The disease they're looking at is treatable already in humans and dogs by antibiotics. And you can avoid dogs getting this illness by giving them tip preventatives. Um, yet, Dr. Fauci's NIAD is poised to waste another hey, half a hey, million. Hey, Justin, dollars. Justin, allow me. Just hey, guys, control, please don't look the keep the nice pictures of the beagles up. I can't watch. I can't do these these torture pictures. Um, Justin, tell our audience if these dogs don't die from being infested with these ticks, what they do with the dogs. And by the way, people wanted to adopt these dogs. But go ahead, tell them what they they're going to do. Yeah, absolutely. The experimental protocol specifically says that the dogs are not going to be sick at the end of the project, but the university, uh, the Kansas State University, funded by Dr. Fauci, is going to kill them anyway by sticking a needle in their hearts and uh, draining their blood. Uh, and that's what's going to happen to these completely healthy, uh, sweet beagles who are being abused on taxpayers' dime. There is just a stunning lack of transparency and accountability about how Dr. Fauci and the NIH are spending tax dollars. And this experiment, this wasteful, cruel, and unnecessary experiment is Exhibit A. Why can't we stop this, Justin? I mean, we've been exposing this for the better part of a year that we've been on television. Does Fauci just not care and, and, and it's not getting to him? Does he even know this is happening? He absolutely knows this is happening. We know he's communicated with Congress about it a little bit. And luckily, we, you know, thanks to you really keeping this issue out in the news and in front of people, you know, we've been really fortunate to uh, bring together a diverse coalition of lawmakers from people like Joni Ernst, Rand Paul, Roger Marshall in the Senate, Nancy Mace, Ralph Norman, James Comer in the House, uh, people in leadership positions in the minority right now who are really holding Anthony Fauci's feet to the fire and, and demanding answers about why these projects are continuing, uh, why dogs are still being killed in these unnecessary experiments. And we're hopeful, particularly depending on how things go in November, uh, that Fauci will really be held accountable for this and other things that he's been wasting taxpayer money on. Yeah, things oh, like the animal experiments. And yeah, you, 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 you keep me in on that list because I, I do want to pursue it and you let us know if there's more. Any way we can move this ball forward to get Fauci to quit spend. Just stop. Stop. It's inhumane. It's disgusting. Awful. Justin Goodman, thanks for being here. Thanks, Eric. All right, come out more balance after this.